Please be seated. Hello, Your Honor. Hello. This is a case of Percy Glenn versus Gail. Thank you, Jerome. Good day, everyone. Good day. Good day. Ms. Percy, you've petitioned the court for a paternity test. You're here to prove to Mr. Gale and his wife that he is the father of your 26-year-old daughter, Tedra Glenn. Yes, Your Honor. You claim that you've spent nearly $200,000 to raise your daughter and he's done nothing. Yes, Your Honor. And now you feel like he needs to pay. Yes, Your Honor. Mr. Gale, you claim you weren't there for Ms. Glenn because you only found out she may be your child when she was 15 years old. Yes, Your Honor. And uh, your biggest fear is that your wife will leave you if you're proven to be the father. Yes, Your Honor. Ms. Percy. Yes. Why do you think Mr. Gale is denying your daughter? Because of his wife. I don't know why she won't let this man be a man and Excuse be me, with Your his Honor. children. Your he Honor. needs to spend time my with his children. My wife never stopped me from seeing any of my kids. Mr. Gale, that is so not true. Every time my daughter calls him, it's like, oh, I can't talk to you right now. Tanya's sitting right here. Right, because I, I don't want to. I don't want to disrespect my this, wife. How would if you I knew that was my daughter, your wife? I could this is talk your daughter. To her. If that I knew that was my daughter. It's your daughter. I could talk to her wherever it's your daughter. I Mr. Gale, tell me, were you all in a committed relationship? It was committed. We was seven years. It wasn't no seven years. You were how long was it? Mm. Like four or five years. No, it wasn't. When I got with her, she was 16, I was 21. Okay. And then when I was 26, I was with my wife. When did you get married? What, what was the date that you and Miss Gale got married? February 23rd, 2002. Really? Miss Teedra Glenn. When is your birthday? October 9th, 1988. Mr. Gale, you got married in February of 2002. How long were you together before that? 15 years. Hello. Wow. Oh. So, if you were together 15 years, that would put you way before... <laughs> you were together with your wife way before... Right, we broke that up Ms. a Glenn long was, time but ago. But we were still sleeping together. We slept together we one time. We were sleeping time. together the whole time you was with Tanya. No, we wasn't. Yes, we slept we together one was. time, Your Honor. He's still trying to sleep with... <laughs> whoa, whoa! <laughs> Woo! That's cute. Um, don't, 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 you. don't lie. Don't lie. Don't lie. Oh, my God. Don't Ooh, may I lie. So the Stop bottom me. line is... Do not lie. The bottom yeah. line is, sometime during the relationship, whether you all were off or on at the time, mm -hmm. Ms. Glenn was conceived, yes. if you are her biological father, well, she during that time. Well, she already had somebody else test it. Mm. So I just, they all of a sudden, the she said, I'm they the father. They wasn't the father. But, so but, you was the other but, possible father. But too. if you had somebody else test, if I was the father, you should have tested me first. Miss Percy, that's, that's a valid question. It's true. If you really that felt he it. was the father, why wasn't he the first man tested? Mm. Because I didn't want to be bothered with him. So why you want to be bothered with me? So what? I, I don't. Honestly, I don't. Honest. It's you. Y'all uh, doing this? I'm not doing this. Right here. May yes, yes, please? yes. Absolutely, Miss. Okay. Lynn. When I was nineteen, I didn't even want to be here. I asked my brother for Mr. Gale's number. When I asked my brother for Mr. Gale, Mr. Gale's number, I called Mr. Gale, and I initiated a paternity test. I said, you know, I've been hearing all my life that you've been my dad and I look just like you. Me and my brother just mm -hmm. look just alike. And, you know, I've been hearing all these rumors, but it's like, at that time, I felt like I was old enough to find out for myself. So when I called Mr. Gale, he was like, well, uh, I understand that you want to find out who your dad is, but you're going to have to pay for the paternity test. Oh, my and God. I would have been, been, which, 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 been fine with that. When I asked her, I said, tell your mother if see if your mother can go half of me on a paternity test. That her was mother after the never fact. got back to me, never said that anything. That was after the fact. That mm -hmm. was just recently. Mm -hmm. no. That was just recently this no. past year no. when no. you was like, oh, you need to find out no. where you really come no. from. No. Like, as if I'm a charity case. No, no. Don't, you not right. don't come back like you're a Ain't nobody think you want no, no charity cake. For you to be no, like, the things that, that you say that. to That's her. That's your mom. Miss Percy, when you got pregnant, did you say to Mr. Gale, "I'm pregnant and I think it's your child"? No, I didn't. You didn't tell no. him a thing. My daughter was two. This man came to my house, and my brother would kept looking at Teacher. We all kept looking at Teacher like, "Damn, she looking different. She looking like this this man here," and I'm like, 
He, he looked at her and he was like, oh, is that my daughter? And I told him, I didn't say yes and I did not say no. I told him it's a possibility. The first time I heard of T.J. being mine was when she was 15, her mother called me. Oh I was God. standing on Market Street in Long Beach. Oh my God. And she said, oh, too, you know T.J. your baby. And I laughed, I thought she was playing. When my wife came home, I told everybody jokingly, my wife was serious. So I stopped smiling. That's, oh what, that's the first That's the lie. That I is know. such a lie. Okay, he I knew see. way before she was Never. 15. Knock it off. Wait, I should Yeah, you it. knock I'm it off. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. You whoa. knock it off and let this man be a father that's to his husband. kid. I can say what I want to say. You knock it off. This my husband. I don't care. That's your problem. I don't want your no, husband. That's your problem. That's your problem. You get your life, baby. Yeah, because I gave it to you. If you want more episodes of Paternity Court, make sure to subscribe and click on the notification bell. This doesn't help, Tidra. No, it doesn't. I, what I, 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 hold on, before I, you, don't before don't you go off, Miss Percy. Thinking about my feelings. This is what I'm, mm. I am. I'm thinking about you. It's about mm. me knowing if this man is my daddy. Yep, we've that's been it. we've been talking for this past year, and when I say when we be on the phone, it's all laughs and giggles, and we talk. Like, this was meant to happen. It's come a time to where every time I get on the phone, she's like, oh, you're on the phone with your little friend? Mm -hmm. Like, as if I'm nothing. I'm somebody. I may not have you had are. a father, but I'm somebody. She, I don't have no problem with her. She's laughing and giggling like it's a joke. And it's not a joke. Your kids grew up with their fathers. I did it. She did it. I did it. it. I did it. I'm about to sit here and act like it's my mama's fault. Because at the end of the day, whether I was 15, whether I was two, whether I was two months, you should have been a woman cannon. and said, this girl don't need to grow up without a father. All right, all right. Ms. Gale, I, I want to hear from you, ma'am. People have had a lot to say about you today. Yeah, I'm a villain. And what I'm trying to understand is, is your marriage on the line, depending on the results of this test? It has been a problem, you know, during our, the, you know, our marriage, because, you know, he stepped out and, you know, he did and deal he with his... he's stepping he, out. It's he not your turn. You already talked, sweetie. Relax yourself. Let, let, let her have um, her chance to speak, Miss Percy. You know, she speak. did. He did do what he did. Okay, but y'all wasn't married. I'm not your turn, sweetie. But it, but y'all wasn't what he married. Let, let her You're right about that, but it was my man. Okay, yeah. Okay, learn something. What happened? After, um, Ernest learned that there's a possibility that could be his child. Mm -hmm. You know, he kind of denied it for the minute because he know I ain't, know, I ain't, I'm playing the game. Yeah. So he went back and forth, and I said, well, tell me, you know, tell me the truth because this is getting ready to be a problem. You know, he went on and said, okay. I did it. Mm -hmm. So I said, okay, you was there. So there's a great possibility that you could be oh. her father. So why because did you, you say was there. Take a paternity test? How do you know what I said? You don't live in my I house, don't, little girl. I don't, but, but look how long it took I'm if he found out if she was 15. Okay, though. you killing me on about how long it took. We're here because you weren't careful. So Who don't come careful? go there. You, don't you okay. talk no, about me. No, I no, was no, careful. No, you were about no husband. That wasn't careful. He wasn't either. Mm. You do, in fact, believe there's a possibility that Miss Glenn could be your husband's child. When you look at her, do you see a resemblance? Could you show her she's the picture? She's on the um, She's trying to be funny. I don't know. I have so evidence. I can't what evidence she do you like have, Miss Glenn? To me. So Jerome, will you me. hand me Miss so Glenn's evidence, picture. please? She so looks she like her mother to me, but that doesn't mean that's not her father. The first piece of evidence is a picture of you... Me and Mr. Gale. And that's Mr. Gale. Yep. ...as children. Yep. And you say there is a definite resemblance. Yep. My nose, my lips, the way my mouth is, my teeth, my eyebrows, Your teeth. my eyes, you see the way I, I everything. The and way then my now, face is this shaped, is a I more can. recent photo of yep. you now. Yep. And you you still feel like you see a resemblance. Yep. Mr. And Gale, do you see a resemblance? All I can all I can see is the DNA test. Whoa, whoa, that's how you feel? When I sent him this picture, you said I look listen, like listen you. Listen to what I'm saying. That's Y'all going too hard on my wife. That's crazy, man. I got my wife back. I got my wife I'm back. Done. I'm so it don't done. matter to me. I'm don't worry about DNA that. Okay. Even if it is, this I'm just going to leave y'all life alone. The Even if you are my daddy, okay. I'm going to leave you alone. That's why you don't he doesn't have me anyway. a relationship with it's my cool. other son. It's cool. I don't need no daddy. other son. I mean, I mean, you only got one with like, uh, All right, all right. All right. I, I, I want to know this. Do you really doubt that she's your child? Are you just... Or are you just fearful of the effect it will have on your fair. marriage? 
So I have to come get tested. I cannot, I'm not going to just say, claim a, a child, and I don't know if she's truly mine. Mm -hmm. I wasn't with her, so I don't know who she been with. Miss Glenn, why is this so important to you today? Honestly, because, one, I have grew up all my life without a dad. I've had a stepfather. He's been there through ups and downs, through thick and thin, and... It's just like, when I see him, it's like, I see me. And this is the honest to God truth. And then on, I don't know if it's a self-conscious thing of me hearing everybody say, oh, you look just like uh, Mr. Gale. Oh, you and Ernest look like my brother. And I don't know where I came from besides my mom. My mom always told me, I'm your mama and your daddy, I regardless. Was, I was there. Of course. I took, I took care of all four of my children uh, by myself. I just want a father. And That's honestly, it. all these years, regardless of the situation between Tanya and my mother, that's I, between them. I which don't is have all nothing against this woman. But at the same time, it's like she, through everything that I've heard, it's like I'm the problem. It's but like you're I'm not the one. Tidra. I know oh. that. I know that. <laughs> but if it's not oh, her, God. it's somebody else making me feel like I'm not nothing. I belong here. I'm done. I've graduated high school without a father. I'm in college. I have four children. My kids don't even know him. Whether yeah. whether he's not my dad or not. This past year. This past year, I have grown so much love for him. Even when I was a yeah. child, I would walk around. My mom would say, oh, our Mr. Gale is coming over to see my brother. And when he would come over, I would get excited, like, as if he was coming like for if me. He was wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. Mr. Gale is coming my to see brother. I have a son. But wait, mom. why wouldn't he be coming to see the both of you? Because I never knew. He knew. He Cause I never knew. knew. If she's my daughter, then I could take on that role. Tanya Before runs your life, her. right? Listen, she runs it. Whatever Listen, Tanya say on. goes. Hold on. Her and Ernest's son stayed with us for four years straight. Excuse me? For four, years, four straight. years straight. Oh, yeah, because he wouldn't bring him back home. Knock it off. I didn't even know you he did that. Four years yeah. straight. I mean, Ernest, I, come okay, on Okay, that's, 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 come good. On. that's fine, though. If okay, that's his son, just... he can live okay. with him for he, four that, years. Exactly. Exactly. Okay. okay. I, I, bet, but I made sure he had clothes. At the same time, I fed him, him like he was mine. What? I drawn him like he was mine. Okay. So, family, 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 I've heard enough. We're not going anywhere. We're not getting anywhere. We're not getting anywhere. We're not. We're not getting anywhere. Well, this is the point I've been waiting Miss Percy, I... I am gonna go to the results now. Oh, thank you, Lord. It's over. It's over. I think it's time. Mm. Now, just to be clear, you said during that time, you had been intimate with two men, and yes. one has already been tested, and the test proved that he, he was not... Father. Yeah. Miss Glenn's father. Yes. Mr. Gale is the other possible, possible father. Yes. So only the only people. other possible father. Yes. This okay. This is crazy. You yeah. told me you're going to love me regardless. I did. You told me that you I was going to be there. I did say you, that. And then you're going to brush but your hand up at me like I ain't nothing? Doing, oh, oh, That's this cool. Is, don't, ladies, don't, ladies and gentlemen, if you'd like to take a seat... too much to me if, and mine. No. Hmm. If you'd like to take a seat for the reading of the results, you're I more than I welcome. I sit down. Do you want to watch Paternity Court on TV? Go to paternitycourt.tv to find your local listings. In the case of Percy Glenn versus Gail, when it comes to 26-year-old Tedra Glenn, it has been determined by this court, Mr. Gail, You are not her father. I hear me, boo. I'll let your girl. Let's roll. <laughs> what, what you talking? <laughs> no problem. Uh, her. Yeah. I'm glad. Yeah. You glad. Yes, I am. You I've dumb. always been glad. You That's why you never glad. knew it. You thought you was going to have me Gale. back up. Oh, please. Mr. Gale and Miss Percy. I can't hear any more of this. <laughs> oh. I want him to be my daddy. Why, though? Oh, Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. He don't care. He doesn't care. <laughs> I want to go hug her, you know, and, and tell her it's going to be all right. I hate to hear her crying like that, you know. So do I. So do I. Mm. 
Uh, ladies and gentlemen, this has been an emotional day. Uh, we're gonna take a short break. Court is in recess. I know that's not what you wanted to hear today. What you don't know he probably is when you left have. the courtroom, the first thing he said was, I feel really bad. He says, and he asked, <laughs> me, could he come give you a hug? And I just told him to give you a moment. Now they can live happily ever after. Well, and don't I don't ever think... have to worry about me. L Let woman. me tell you something. Let me tell you something. <laughs> One thing that I know for certain is their actions have no bearing on you, your life, your destiny, or your purpose. I watched you stand out there and express yourself your hopes, your disappointments, your fears, everything. And that took a level of strength that quite frankly, Mr. Gale and his wife didn't have today. And you know what? If you gotta cry for the next two weeks to get it out, you just do that. Look at me. You pick up the pieces, you put one foot in front of the other, and you just keep on stepping. No, sorry. Let me give me a hug. Oh, girl. I'm sorry. <laughs>